Hello, everybody. This is Darren Redman for Redman's Wrap-Up, brought to you by FHT Sports. It's November 15th, Thursday evening, as we like to call it, Weekend Eve. If you're downtown Fresno tonight at Selen Arena, and if you aren't, you need to ask yourself, why not? The brand of hockey we have here, we're privileged to see from the Fresno Monsters at Selen Arena, should sell itself. And I tell you, if there's any term, any one word that is should sell itself. And I tell you, if there's any term, any one word that is a, a, a just a moniker for the Fresno Monsters, uh, run by, uh, coached by uh, Killer Kevin Kaminsky, is this, resilient. This is a resilient hockey team. Unfortunately, we've seen this in the past, giving up some late goals to end the period. Tonight, 12 seconds left, 1-1 one, one tie. We give up a goal uh, with 12 seconds left. It becomes 2-1. And then later, 3-1. Valencia Flyers ahead. But this resilient hockey team battles back. Tonight, Filipov was, the, was the, the main star of the game. He had not one, but two goals tonight, including the game winner. Sometimes short comes up big. Short-handed goal. With about four minutes to play to put the Fresno Monsters ahead. Truex was the second star of the game. And Denayev was the third star of the game. This game had a lot of action. There was an ebb and flow to it. And again, when you saw the Fresno Monsters down 3-1, there was no panic. You just had this feeling that they were just going to do what they need to do. What what happens from a killer Kaminsky coach team? The team stays true to their form. They play like a team. They're going to hit you. Did you see that hit late in the game by Damangala? If you haven't, get your tickets, come down to Selen Arena, and go watch. It was old school, clean, beautiful hit at its best, like a captain should. Well done. Well done indeed. So, what does this mean? This means now that the Fresno Monsters have 24 points, sitting at 8 and 6 on the year, ready to track down the Long Beach Bombers. They have, I believe, 31 points right now. But a nice sweep of the Valencia Flies this weekend will close that gap down as we move into the month of December and a little bit of a break. So, if you weren't at the game tonight, I hope this kind of gives you a feeling of what it was like. Come tomorrow night, come Saturday night to Selen Arena, cheer on the Fresno Monsters. Just a great game uh, they, they play tonight. Again, how many teams are down 3-1? They just pack their tent, they go home. Tomorrow's another night. No, not the Fresno Monsters. A killer Kaminsky coach team is resilient. They stay on track. They look for those weaknesses that the other team provides during the course of the game and exploit them. They'll tighten up giving up those late goals. I predict another victory tonight for the Fresno Monsters and it's Saturday as well. So, hope to see you there. This is Darren Redman from FHT Sports. Like, subscribe, share. What do you think? What do you think? What's been the highlight this year of the Fresno Monsters as they make their move? They always do. Remember, we had suspensions early in the year, the Fresno Monsters did, and we had some injuries, the Fresno Monsters did. But Kill Kaminsky has this team as a cohesive unit. Look out, look out, WSHL. This Western Division not only is up for grabs, it's not if the Fresno Monsters win, it's by how much they win this division. Let's all make a commitment to get out to sell an arena to cheer on this resilient hockey team that is so fun to watch. Darren Redman from FHT Sports. Have a great Thursday evening. Stay healthy. Stay safe. Fresno Monsters, Friday night, Saturday night. Thank you.